Hello and welcome everyone in this video it is going to be the special edition one because I just hit 1000 subscribers if you enjoy this video make sure you subscribe to my channel for unique and awesome content that you can only get right here now let's get started and this video we're going to be comparing the content and the tasting it's going to be a tasting video and of course the tasting video is going to be all about which kind of honey you should be getting now the first thing I had a lot of people were asking me the question is why do I like Manuka honey why do I enjoy eating this weird looking honey that I called Manuka honey and if you google the internet about what Manuka honey is you will find out there's a lot of benefits to it so there was a comparison between the cheap honey which is about two bucks or so versus the Manuka honey which goes from maybe 15 bucks all the way to 50 to even a hundred dollars for one of those so you might be asking what is the reason and why should you actually do it now there's hundreds of health benefits to actually getting the real honey first of all the reason why the honey is really good for you is that it contains very good complex energy and when you eat this you feel not only full you feel healthy you feel great it healing properties and the more better the honey actually is the more health benefits it gives it to you the cheap honey has a lot of sugar in it and because it has a lot of sugar in it it's not really good for you you want to get the most pure the best honey in fact the best kind of honey out there is to go to the real source and going and climbing the tree and getting the real deal is only for the super brave and of course unless you want to go and end up with thousands of different bee stings I don't really suggest for you to actually do this so on the other hand let's go and do the comparison I don't have the regular honey because I don't even eat it so we we'll have to go into the expensive honey and figure out which one starting from this one right here all the way to that one so we're starting with the cheapest one this is the cheapest one the Manuka honey you can get this at Trader Joe you can also get all of those things in, in Amazon as well and I'm gonna have links right below so you can grab any of those and it's gonna be delivered to you fast and easy that's how I get all my Manuka honeys and my entire collection here now we're gonna be starting with this one so this is the Trader Joe Manuka honey and we have the tasting right here very small amount for the tasting it is yummy but the problem with this specific one the Trader Joe edition there is just too much sugar it is too sweet now if you like sweet stuff yeah this is great but I think there was just they put a lot of extra sugar in this so because of that I'm not sure that you should be actually getting uh, the Trader Joe version unless you want to save up on money if you want to get the real deal you gotta go into those brands right here now next one and next one we're going to be picking this oh this one. oh ow. this one right here this is the organic wild collected raw honey from Trader Joe this one comes from special uh, neom flowers it has been harvested in central India this is kind of cool so you, you get the stuff that's coming directly from India itself and the, the cool thing about it is that this is the honey that you can get if you lived in India now you might be asking well should I be getting this specific honey or should I get the Trader Joe honey right and the Manuka honey note one thing about this this is the organic wild collection raw honey from Trader Joe but this is not Manuka honey which comes to the point and let's go back into it I only get Manuka honey so this is not Manuka honey it tastes like honey but is it honey well it says 100% raw wild honey well this is the one right here yeah, let's see what it says here you can see what is it okay ingredients Manuka honey and that's it but the sugar it says 17 on it 17 grams of sugar on um, this one here 16 grams of sugar you, you wonder if they actually added like extra sugar 
to those to make them more sugary. All right, next one. This is the Manuka honey UMF 15 plus. Now, the higher the number, the more medicinal uh, properties that it has. It can heal sores, it can heal things on the inside. That's what honey is all really great about. Remember, bears actually eat this. These huge animals eat honey and they have so much energy. Remember how big they are. They need huge amount of energy to function and honey gives it to them. This one, this specific one, it says take one, two to three spoons a day. Yeah, so you can finish it faster, right? And the ingredients are all the same, but this one has the 15 UMF. And this one is product of New Zealand. So you're getting one that comes directly from New Zealand itself versus the other ones here, which we're going to be checking where they're coming from as well. But New Zealand is a great place. So you're getting the real deal and the real Manuka honey. So let's go into the tasting portion of this one right here. Taste the like raw honey, right? Like the, I like it. I like the taste. There is, there is just enough here to give you the honey boost in it. But it doesn't taste like sugar. And I like that. So this one is pretty delicious. I would say on a scale of delicious, this actually tastes good and it doesn't taste like medicine, which is the good part of it. It's more sweet, but it is sweet that it tastes like honey, as if this one tastes like pure sugar in some ways. I'm not too a fan of that one. But this one is good. I like that one. And the company itself that does this is a very famous company called Corn Lan Tao, something like that. And there's going to be a link right below in the video for this one, which I highly recommend for you to get. Now, this one is the Manuka Honey, and this is Manuka Health with green tea extract. So it actually combines two of my favorite foods all in one, the green tea plus Manuka Honey. Both of them combined, which is double delicious and since i like green tea and honey let's go and taste this a little bit mm, i like that and now i'm biased here because i like the green tea but we don't know the problem is with this one i don't know how much green tea extract actually exists in here but we know that it has honey in it so i'm getting double healthy here by getting green tea with honey double extract right now i like this one because you're getting both of them at the same time but again if you just want to get the pure honey this probably is not going to be for you it plus it doesn't even say the rating on it which is not good so this one has the rating which is 15 plus this one doesn't have a rating at all this one like here boston honey company raw local honey that's not even manuka honey it's some kind of a honey that i got here it's the real raw deal it's like they captured this and somewhere away from the honeybees and unfortunately this one would not be tasted because it is sealed so <clears throat> i don't want to get something that's already sealed i have to wait for that one next one is the manuka raw honey the black version of it the only reason i'm saying it's black version because the whole box is black so this one what's the properties on that one it has actually a ufc number which is 15 plus on this one it is the kaya brand you know the smell test actually forced and smells good By far, this is the nastiest one of the world, then. that's for sure. But I actually like it because I think this is the real, real deal. I think the more bad it actually tastes, the better it is. And I mean, it bad isn't bad. It like it doesn't have the sugary taste to it that you're used to with honey. So I'm thinking that this is going to give me the real deal because. It doesn't have the sugary taste to it so they probably have no sugar in here it's probably just the real deal itself 
and it doesn't taste as great as those two right here but if you're talking about the medicinal properties i think this one has them all this one we're gonna skip on it's also sealed so, eh. and that one is the wild cape uh manuka honey umf 10 which is gonna be the last one we'll be tasting Uh, this one is really sweet it's not as sweet as Trader Joe but it is pretty good so I would say out of all the tasting number one my favorite number two actually surprisingly is my favorite number three is like this one number four would be that one and number five would be this one and we have to skip those two because they were closed and this one is totally not my favorite as well so out of those i showed you which ones i like the most and now the only thing i'm going to be asking you to do if you enjoyed any of those and you want to get them for yourself there's going to be links right below which ones i recommend which ones you should be getting and also make sure you subscribe to my channel because i want to see you on the inside and give you more awesome videos such as this one so enjoy this Enjoy the toasting and enjoy the tasting and see you in another video.